Hello students, it's Shana, your teacher from EspressoEnglish.net, and our phrasal verb of the day is wrap up. Today I'm going to teach you one phrasal verb, but if you'd like to learn 15 or 20 more phrasal verbs, then click on the link in the video for a free sample lesson from my course, Phrasal Verbs in Conversation. The free sample lesson will teach you 15 to 20 phrasal verbs just in that lesson. And in the whole phrasal verbs course, you'll learn about 500 of the common phrasal verbs that native English speakers use. So make sure to check that out. All right, let's learn about wrap up. Does wrap up mean A, bring something to an end, B, get to the next level, or C, make something look better. As I describe a situation using this phrasal verb, post a comment and guess whether A, B, or C is the correct definition for wrap up. Let's say you're at work, you're in a meeting, and the meeting is scheduled to run for one hour. And during the meeting, you and your coworkers talk about a lot of different topics. And after about 50 minutes, your manager says, all right, before we wrap up, does anyone have anything else to add? And someone raises their hand and they say, yes, I'd like to discuss, and they uh, mention another topic. So everyone talks about that for a little while. And then eventually your manager says, okay, now that we've covered that, let's wrap it up. Based on this example, does wrap up mean A, B, or C? I hope it was clear from the situation that the correct answer is A. Wrap up means to bring something to an end. So in this example, uh, the meeting was supposed to go for one hour, and after 50 minutes, so 10 minutes before the end, the manager said, before we wrap up, does anyone have anything else to add? So before bringing the meeting to an end, uh, he wanted to see if there was anything else to discuss. And then after discussing another topic for about 10 more minutes, your manager said, okay, let's wrap it up, meaning let's end this meeting, let's bring it to a close, let's finish it. Today we are wrapping up our series of daily phrasal verb videos. This was a special project for the month of February, and today is the last day, so we're wrapping it up. If you missed any of the previous videos or if you'd like to review them, just click on my YouTube channel and look for the phrasal verbs playlist and you'll see all of the daily phrasal verb videos there. But I'd encourage you not to stop here because there are a lot more phrasal verbs to learn. So make sure to check out my course, Phrasal Verbs in Conversation, which will help you learn a lot more phrasal verbs. Thank you for watching me today. Bye-bye.